This is question 18 from a series of videos taking a look at the Edexcel practice papers. Here we're told that the graph shows the velocity, v meters per second, of a rocket at time t seconds. What we can see is we've got a graph here with time going along the x-axis and velocity going up the y-axis. Then what we're asked to do is we're asked to find an estimate for the rate of change of the velocity of the rocket at t equals 2. So the first thing that we're going to do is translate what is meant by this term, rate of change. And we can think of this as being the gradient. So essentially what we are being asked to do here is we are being asked to find out what is the gradient at t equals 2. Now, the problem we're trying to figure out what the gradient is at t equals 2 is if we think about our curve, the gradient of this curve is constantly changing. The steepness is different at different points. It's not a straight line where the gradient is constant. So in order to figure out what our gradient is going to be, what we're going to do is we're going to draw a tangent at t equals 2. So a tangent, a tangent is just a line which just touches the graph at a particular point. So we're going to draw a straight line at where t equals 2. So a straight line, I'm not happy with that. Um, let's try that again. So a straight line at where t equals 2. So it just has to just touch the graph. So you'll need to do this with a ruler. Um, and it should look something like that. So just touching at t equals 2. So oh, I'm going to try that one more time. So at t equals 2, just there. There we go, that's better. So it's just touching that graph at t equals 2. And now what we are going to do is we're going to figure out what is the gradient of this tangent that we've just drawn. So what I'm going to do here is if I think about what the gradient is, remember what we've said about the gradient before, the gradient is the amount that y changes by. So the amount, the change on the y-axis when x, the x-axis, increases by 1. So one way that we can do this is by drawing a little triangle. And so we've moved across by 1 on the x-axis. What have we moved up by on the y-axis? So what I can see here is I've moved across on the x-axis by 1, and I have increased on my y-axis, I would say that's about 9, and that is at 20. So we could say that I've moved across by 1, and I've gone up by, I think, 11. So then my final answer here is find an estimate for the rate of change. That is simply going to be, so 11 is our gradient. Our gradient is 11. And so our final answer is going to be 11. The rate of change and the velocity of the rocket at t equals 2 is 11.